All right, so I just pulled up a handful of dirt right here and I just saw a little flash. So I heard something right here. I just sort of kicked the wood chip back, and I think I see what this is. I'm guessing by the VGI, this is going to be a Jefferson nickel. Let's see. Yep, there is the. I guess that's Monticello, right, on the back of the Jefferson nickel. And yeah, he's kind of stained, but there's President Jefferson on the obverse. Let's keep digging. Alright, I hate that I already kicked the wood chips back in the hole where you can't see how close this is. It's supposed to air like whoop, 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 whoop. Off the high tone off of this post right here. This post here, you probably can't see where it came from. But it's on this. It is a Nike zipper. Pretty neat. Let's keep on a digging. Alright, right. so I just found something that's kind of neat. It's a little stud right here. I don't know exactly what this is. You know, maybe there was, I'm thinking back to my youth, maybe there was some punk rocker in this uh, tot lot. I don't know, but you know, classic little pointy metal stud. Ah, dig it, let's keep on digging. All right, so I heard a pretty sweet little high tone right down here. And it was on the edge of sort of wood chip depth. So I didn't want to live dig it, but I popped the edge. I think I see something. And let's see if I can pull this out. Let's see what we got. So it looks like President Roosevelt to me. Uh, let's see if we can get a date. I can't read the date, but I mean, looking at the edge, just a cloud dime. 10 cents richer. Let's keep on uh, digging, right? All right, so I just pulled up a handful of dirt right here, and I just saw a little flash, and I got excited. But tis but a pencil eraser, but the color of that bright gold color, I'm gonna say it, even though I didn't find the whole pencil. But I'm gonna guess that is a Ticonderoga, right? Let's keep digging. The old classic, right there. The old Pullis. Pull us a taboos. Keep digging. Well, alrighty. Ruthie just ran inside, but you ready to do a quick see how they run up lodge? Mm -hmm. Well, I went to a couple of tight lots today. So if you guys don't know, so today is Lundy Girl. Tomorrow is Mardi Girl. Ruthie had her beads a second ago, but I don't know where she went. <laughs> But uh, like you guys will be seeing this on Mardi Gras. I guess the video will release on Mardi Gras. But I didn't have a ton of success today. Uh, you know, uh, I got a handful of coins. You saw everything uh, that I got in the video. Not a big deal, but uh, you know, it is what it is. You know, hey, this is real, real metal detecting, right? I mean. Sometimes you find treasure, sometimes you find a whole lot of nothing. And, uh, oh, hey, there's Ruthie with her fancy sunglasses. I'm sorry, Ruthie, you don't have beads uh, anymore, I, but. I, my princess, and I like to eat blue, and strawberries. Excellent, Ruth. Excellent. Well, like I say, uh, we had fun, uh, or I had fun out detecting, uh, you know, like I say, tomorrow is Mardi Gras, so, you know, les le bon temps roule, whatever, enjoy yourself, be safe. Uh, Mr. Lodge, if people aren't subscribed to CLA or Metal Detecting on YouTube, what should they do? Like, subscribe, and comment on the video. Absolutely, and click that notification bell so you never miss an episode. And I'm in this video, too. Absolutely, and of course, you guys know, we'll be back here next Tuesday. And of course, CLAR, as always, we dig it all. Mr. Lodge. 24-6. That's right.